Good evening, I'm Leah Lando from 7 News, and we are taking you through the 716 in two minutes, beginning with a developing story concerning the attempted murder of a police officer here in the Queen City. This scary scene unfolding near the corner of East North and Orange Streets in Buffalo's Fruit Belt neighborhood. Authorities were responding to a call regarding some kind of a threat that was just after 2.30 this morning. Officials telling us that's when an armed man opened fire on responding officers. We're told one officer did return fire, but nobody was hit. The suspect, identified as 36-year-old Sharif Shadwick of Buffalo, was arrested a few blocks away. Police say they recovered two weapons. You see them right here on your screen. The weapons were a loaded 45 caliber in Wesson and a loaded 9mm Glock 17 with a high-capacity extended magazine. Shadwick is facing a number of charges, including the attempted murder of a police officer. Police telling us the suspect was on parole at the time of the incident. All right, a lot going on in the world of weather, so let's check in with meteorologist Mary Beth Robel with the uh, forecast. Well, Leah, a severe thunderstorm watch is posted till 10 o'clock tonight for the southern tier. That includes Chautauqua, Cattaraugus, Allegheny counties, also our northern Pennsylvania viewing area. The main threat, damaging wind gusts and hail, and it looks like the main uh, bulk of the rain will come after midnight for the southern tier. Some places could pick up one to two inches of rain in a very short period of time. So localized flooding, damaging wind gusts could be a real issue. We'll dry it out into tomorrow into Tuesday. We're going to lose all this humidity once we kick off the new work week. Tonight, though, showers and thunderstorms, muggy and windy, overnight lows in the low 70s. Tomorrow, showers ending, cooler, less humid as we get into the afternoon with highs in the low 70s. And it's a great looking seven day forecast. We lose all that searing heat. We're back into the 70s.